Market uh, definitely does not have enough workers or energy or stone. Hmm. What can we upgrade? Sniper, lookout tower. Might just sit back and watch when the real hordes start coming. Yeah, the, the towers don't move, but from what I've seen, anytime I try moving them, uh, as far as like my troops go, it doesn't really turn out well for me. There we go. Shocking tower, power plant. Power plant is probably what I should have done since I'm so low on power right now. Still not enough workers. Mm, I, st I got the energy needed. Not enough workers. Wood, stone, and gold. Well, by the time I get enough stone, I think I'll have enough gold. I still gotta upgrade these things. Jeez. It's one thing after another. Come on, give me some stone. I think I will build maybe one or two more of those uh, stone quarries. Yeah, I'll shut them down later, but just because we're trying to upgrade all our walls and, you know, the, the houses are going to use stone. Earlier in the game, man, like I said, it wasn't being used for anything, so I thought it was worthless, but definitely not. Come on. Oh, now I don't have enough workers, huh? Uh, well, if I do this, it's going to use up more of my energy, and I won't be able to, uh... I won't be able to build it, so I need to build another house. Let's do the power plant. If I can do the power plant, I can just upgrade this thing. For whatever it's worth. I don't have to do another house. 180 gold. Uh, market will sell back automatically the excess, and that's what I need, because I'm really not using wood right now, and I have three lumber mills going. I could just turn one of those off for now, and turn it back on here in a minute. We need stone, and we need gold. Well. <laughs> stone. Ah, let's do it. Let's build another one. Yeah, we're going to bite the bullet on that. There we go, finally. We're using a little bit of wood. <laughs> Not getting enough gold, though. Uh, we don't really need another farm yet, I don't think, so I'm not going to waste resources on that. Stone, come on, 35. We're getting four at a time. This better be worth it. It's uh, slowing me down dramatically. I haven't upgraded any of my walls yet. I haven't put down any more towers. And I should be able to actually upgrade these things now, too, so... Come on, jeez. No? I can't, uh, I can't upgrade those? I thought I built the thing for the shocking towers. Maybe not. And we still gotta do the foundry for the iron. Ah, okay, so the shocking towers are different towers all together. That requires a whole lot of energy. Here we go. You said put these next to our houses, right? As close to our houses as we can get them. Uh, that looks like it covers all the houses, actually, right there. So that is a good spot. Shocking towers aren't that good. Executor. I thought the shocking towers were pretty good. But we'll go with uh, y'all's suggestion and just uh, go with the, the foundry so we can get the iron going uh, as soon as we can. Let's see. We're going to go ahead and turn this thing back on when we can. Energy and stone. Still can't upgrade these. Power plant. Oh, right, so power plant is completely different from the 
What is this? The lumber mill? The mill? Stone and eight workers. Yeah, I'm not surprised it takes that much stone. Sucks, but I'm not surprised. Ah, uh, we need more energy, so we're gonna have to bite the bullet and do another one of these <clears throat> before we even get a chance to do the new one. But we might be able to tear these things down, kind of clear up the space. If you can get the, the executor and upgrade the walls, four thick, two with the space, and another two, you'll have a chance. I don't know if we'll be able to get four thick on these things. Uh, we'll give it a shot. I mean, I'm still trying to get all these things to stone. Definitely not doing too hot on that yet. Seven energy. Stone, almost to 30. And we need more workers. Always need more workers. Uh, what's the next wave that they attack on? Do you guys know? I mean, I'm at 36 days. And my walls. Yeah. I need to concentrate on them. I think I, I will have to stop here in a second what I'm doing and go to the walls instead. Put down those towers. Hey, I'll go ahead and do that. I wanted to get the energy going. I, I have to get the energy going. But as soon as that's done... Oh my god, how much stone did I use building those houses? <sighs> Let's see, what can we upgrade? Bank, increase the amount of gold generated by each colonist and the surrounding dwellings. Uh, foundry, a thousand. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that since we're getting close to being maxed out on our gold. Get more quarries. Uh, you know, it's like I said, it's a catch-22. If I get more quarries, it uses more energy and stone. If I do that, I can't build a power plant, which I'm desperately low on power. So I kind of want to get this one power plant down. And then I'll go ahead and start putting down the quarries and the uh, the towers. But this is really holding me up right here. It's close. I'm at 29. I need 30. Just wants to drill that in a little bit. Now, I thought you said the, the market would sell the stuff for me automatically once it got to the max. But it's not selling my wood. So let me go ahead and sell a little bit for it. Come on. Now I got the stone. I just don't have the wood. Wow, it's going to take 50 wood to build this, too. I didn't even notice that. Maybe it's not auto. Yeah, I guess maybe that might be a feature that it unlocks later on. There we go. There's my tower. Now we can actually do something. Let's see. Corey needs 30 wood and four workers. Again, workers is a thing. I might just put down a couple of small houses. Could be nice. It's uh, definitely going to increase my income. And give me a very easy thing to upgrade down the road. Right here around my bank. Yeah, it's going to be perfect. Might even be able to do a little bit up here on the top. Place tents, then upgrade them eventually. Yeah. Here we go. The quarry. That's the... Well, I guess I could do one over here. Not really. I had to get rid of this house, I think. Let me... Let me get rid of that house and see if I can put down a quarry. Because it's going to be right next to both of these resources, so... It'll be able to get me iron and stone, which I think is going to be more valuable to me in the end. So we've got a decent amount of stone coming in. Let's see, can we build... We need wood for this one. Well, getting 22 at a time. Stone, we're only getting six. Tesla Tower... I want to build at least one of these so I can see the range of it. Maybe I can put them like dual layer Tesla towers in front because it's probably shorter range. And then the uh, the other. Yeah, look at that. It's really, really short range on that. 
Let's get rid of this. Saving game. I did not like that, huh? Let's get rid of this. We'll put this one down. And we'll put down the... Uh, the archery tower behind it and see if they overlap enough to make it worthwhile. Tin stone. 50 iron. So let's go ahead and sell just a tiny bit of our iron. To the west. Yeah, but what west? Like, that's, that's the question. Is it going to be this west? Is it uh, this top west? Never know. And I should build at least a row of stone towers up here just to give my my buildings a chance. Let's see, can I put one more down? I can. Uh man, that that had to be really really close to make that valuable. Why can't I put it right there? I do not like that. Let's put it right there, I guess, for now. And we might tear this down so we can put another building there. Let's go ahead and repair what we got. I used all my stone. In fact, let me go ahead and pause it real quick. I got a decent amount of money on me, so let me see if I could just buy a little bit. Go ahead and finish up at least one wall. Can't build with uh, one block space. Okay. I think they're going to come up here again. Really do. Mm. Yeah, let's do it just in case. Yep, there they go again up here. Well, I do have all my soldiers inside this little area. They are going to kill themselves on... Oh, no. Are they going to get in? They might. They might actually get in. They're going to knock down at least one layer of walls, that's for sure. Aren't they? Wow, these stone walls are amazing. No, they got through one of them. Not enough. Not enough over here. We need more damage. Oh, there they go. They got through two. Come on, guys. I got faith. Uh, will they do it? I think they might. I think they I think they did it, guys. I think they barely got there, but they got there in time. Woo! All right. Well, they like this area on the top. This is just it's west, it's north, it don't matter. It's it's what they're going to do. So, we need to concentrate a little bit more up here, I think in the end. Let's do stone walls. Yeah, stone walls as much as we can. Let's do some more spike strips. You guys are good. Hey, sir, evening. Uh, sorry about earlier playing some Kingdom Come. The gang looks... Ah, this is an amazing game, dude. This is the furthest I've gotten in it so far. It's uh, definitely difficult. They, they up that factor. But we're going to be playing a little bit of EQ in a little bit. So if you guys are up for it, I think Chupa was on uh, about an hour ago. You should put your troops out there to unveil it. Well, you know what I could do is just upgrade to the lookout tower. It's only 300 gold. And we can sell a little bit of our wood to supply that little bit of our iron as well. And I think I want to build the bank next. So let's... see if we can get some of that going wow you don't really get a lot for wood huh let's go ahead and do the bank was that the bank uh, I want to do the foundry actually I think I already have access to it so let's see what do we need we need 20 workers uh, 50 iron and that's gonna be my full set of iron right there and 2,000 gold that's gonna be maxed out on gold as well man all right, well, we do need it. 
But it didn't say anything about stone, right? Stone was only 30, so we can use stone to upgrade some of this stuff. Well, at least, like you said, two rows of twos. Got wood maxed out, so let's... Let's go ahead and get this side over here. This side definitely needs a little bit more love. I wasn't able to get all of it, though. I think I'm going to tear uh, this down and build another tower. This tower is going to go... Right here? I think that should expose all of that. How's my wood doing? That ah, wood's going okay. Iron, a little bit more than I need at the moment. Make that north wall twice as thick as it is. Yeah, we could do that. We're going to have to build a... Um, let me sell a little bit of this wood. We're going to have to build a Tesla tower, which means we're going to need another worker. Let's upgrade a few of these. Wood, huh? Alright, well, we found a reason to save a little bit of wood. Power, power plant eats... Well, well, I guess that's a good thing, but at the moment, I was really just... Oh my god. Yeah, that opens up into something else. Jeez. If only I could hit it from this side. I might be able to if the towers... Like these things right here... They might be able to hit it like one or two of them over there. It probably wouldn't be efficient Probably wouldn't be a good use of my towers uh, Unless I just have you know resources to burn and I don't really want to go out there and expand any further, but yeah, that's uh, that's a lot of mobs A lot more than I like I might actually put down Another tower right over here Just to expand this area so I can see what's going on and we'll probably put another one down over here, too. Hmm. Must be separated by four cells. So there's... There's absolutely nowhere we can put this thing except for like maybe way over here. I guess I'll put it right there. It doesn't uh, count as a person, I don't think, so it's just going to get destroyed really quickly. Mm, move your choke point up, expand into there, and have them set up a new one. Next horde is going to be south, I bet. South could use a little bit of a reinforcement. It hasn't been upgraded at all for stone. So let's do a little bit on that. Can we do the foundry yet? No, we still need 20 workers. Iron. Iron's almost there. Gold is not. Let's do the workers first. Still doing more wood. Let's go ahead and sell a little bit of our iron while we wait. Building completed. Attention. Building completed. This is still going strong over here. We're at 26. We need 2,000. Hmm. Twenty workers. Still not enough workers. Even with all these houses upgraded. Oh man, we're going to have to cost ourselves a little bit more. There we go. Well, at least every time we upgrade the house, I know it's it's bringing more workers in. It's giving us more gold in the long run. I think that's going to help us, but it's kind of a pain in the butt to have to do all these things. Stone towers. I don't want to waste the resources on that. Not really into building uh, snipers this time around. I like the towers better. Let's see how we doing. Still not enough workers. These workers are killing me. How do I see how many workers I got? Worker supply. Okay, so I have 10. I have 10 workers. I need 20. 
Oh, number of workers supplied by that building. All right, so I got the workers. I need the stone and I need the gold. And we're very close on the gold, at least. Probably get that on the next tick. The stone, we actually, we're really close on that, too. We're getting nine a tick. We might have to buy a little bit once our money goes up. So let's, let's purchase one. Bottom right. It's a hand holding the wrench. But, oh, okay, okay. So 26 of them. Uh, let's go ahead and buy another stone. Uh, yeah, we'll buy another stone and we'll sell off a little bit of wood. So on that next tick, we'll be maxed out on our gold and we'll be maxed, or not maxed out on our stone, but we'll have enough to build it. <laughs> Which, again, may not be the right move. I probably should be expanding, uh, like Big Ton was telling me, but I... I want the iron to be used on something, you know? Like, I want it to be done so I can I can do the research up here. So let's go ahead and put this... Let's put it down here. We're, uh, was that a smart move? Probably not. It's too close to the towers, and I have even less space to do, like, two rows like I really, really wanted to. Might have been able to put them up here instead, but I don't want to destroy that now. Iron is used to make soldiers. Really? So you don't have, like, iron walls or anything, huh? I really hoping for that next upgrade. Let's see. Wood. We're going to sell some more wood. And we're going to upgrade a few more of these walls here. Come on, foundry. No, stone is max. They should have iron walls, dude. Like, I, if you looked at the tower that I took over on the last one, which was the, the shocking tower, it had these these uh, giant stone or metal walls with, like, rebar coming out of it. And that was cool looking, so I thought maybe eventually I'd get access to that. Because it's in the game already, but... Yeah, I couldn't repair them. I couldn't do anything with it, so maybe that's something they will be adding. I would love, like, hot air balloons. Like, I don't, you don't know if you really want to go with airplanes. Maybe airplanes would be kind of cool. But, like, hot air balloons kind of brings me back to the day of Warcraft. Where you could have, like, the orcs up there. and What do we got here? Let's, uh, let's go ahead and pause it while we're looking at this. New structure. Radar tower watches the surrounding area and alerts from nearby enemies and other threats. Radar towers have a greater range of vision. Okay, right, not too bad. Wire fence trap. So maybe those are the upgrades. Set a strong barbed wire fence that will cause damage to the nearby enemies and make them walk slower. I like that. Executor. There we go. That's the item you were talking about before. Attack tower. Attacks nearby enemies inflicting massive damage within the area effect of 0.6 cells radius. Defensive barrier 1000. View range is 12 and workers are 4. So it's going to double the amount of workers I need per building. So I'm going to need a lot more housing. Oil platform. Oil platform generates oil, must be placed over an oil pool. Uh, I have not used oil yet, so I'm not quite sure, you know, what buildings are going to require oil. Maybe the executor might require that, so we might have to do a little bit of uh, of that. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell. Though. Advanced mill generates energy from the colony. Okay, well, we can upgrade. Advanced farm. Uh, yeah, yeah, advanced quarry. That might be worth it. That might actually be worth it. It's 1500 though. And Engineering Center, a new structure, Engineering assemb Center, assembles and trains the most sophisticated units. Uh, let's see, Titans, Lucifer, enables Titans. Sounds cool, Titans in video games usually are pretty amazing. Those are all upgrades, upgrades your existing buildings, okay. Uh, we're going to wait, and we're going to do the Executor at 3,000, but it's going to take us a minute to do that. Uh, I hope that's a right decision. <laughs> Considering I don't have a lot of towers down here yet, and it might be a better idea to put down a few towers and then upgrade those as uh, the resources allow me to. Because there's no towers down here at all, and I think this is like my weakest point ever. But we're gonna we're gonna hold off and hopefully feel like we're going down the right path on that. 3,000. Shouldn't, you know, again, 
I don't even think I can get to 3,000, right? 2,000 is my highest? So I need to build a warehouse, which I've never built. Eight workers, wood, and stone. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait on that one because that's a lot of workers. So what we end up doing here is going with a wire fence. Um, that will give me something to play around with until I can do the other ones. Upgrade your existing buildings, mech armor, steampunk mechs. Steampunk mech sounds cool. Yeah, it sounds dangerous. So it's not like, oh, look at me, I'm like the end all be all because you got like the steam generated, you know, factory on your back, which definitely seems like a vulnerability. You know, it's going to explode at the first sign of like the tiniest little touch, but it uh, it's probably going to be pretty sweet looking. You know, maybe not the nicest thing to wear ever, but bank to increase max money or the warehouse. Yeah, I think the warehouse is the way to go. Stone is going to take a little while, though. Let's see. We're going to have to upgrade a couple more buildings here. Or we can just put down a couple more. I guess what we could do is put down a couple more. I don't really want to upgrade at this exact moment. Oh, man. This would be a nice little spot to build into, but I can't. That's what the Titan and those other things are. They're steampunk mech suits. Attention. Can I do a warehouse? I can. I can do a warehouse finally. Oh man, this is like the only place I can do it, and I can't do that until I build one of these things. Alright, so I guess let's go ahead and build one of those. How are we doing on resources? Actually getting a little bit of ahead of ourselves. Let's finish those up. These we can upgrade with iron and gold. So that's not too bad. That's actually pretty nice. So since you think it's going to be from the south, let's, let's upgrade these from the south. I guess we'll have to do one at a time though. Should be good though for a while. Gold is okay. Forty stone. We got wood we can sell. Let's go ahead and buy a little bit of stone. Forty wood. That's just one tick. And the stone's almost there. Whether we can put it down is another story, though, if it's going to fit up here in the top little area. Come on. Come on, Wood. You can do it. Gold is a resource on the ground, like iron and stone. You can quarry it. Uh, there are also little gift baskets you can pick up as well that I've noticed. Expanding up here doesn't look like it's going to happen anytime soon. Like, I got to protect all my other assets first and build up my towers. Like, this... It seems like I'm doing okay, but I think I'm getting lucky. I think they just haven't attacked me from the regions where it's really going to wipe the floor with me. How are you doing? All right. Uh... Yeah, yeah, we're going to put one of these down. Oh, man. Will it not fit? Let's get rid of this. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Let's get rid of this. We'll build a new one here in a second. Somewhere... Like that, I guess. Building completed. All right, so we've got a bigger warehouse now. We can finally hold a little bit more resources. South Valley looks like the least protected, but I'm watching in low quality. So it is the least protected. 
they haven't really hit it that much. They've actually been hitting up here, which I always thought, thought was going to be like the worst area because it's just so small. I can't put very many towers down, but it's actually been holding its own really, really well. And we can put that one there. Huh. I don't like that. That's all I can put over here. That sucks. We might have to put another row of towers, like, right here when we finally get to that point. Where are they coming from? From the west. From the west. That's anybody's guess where the west is going to be for these people. Uh, it looks like probably this area is where they're going to attack from. This is seems to be the go-to area when they attack from the west. Hey guys, and welcome to the disembodied voice of AC Gamer. We are definitely going to be doing a lot more series in the future, but here are a few of them that you guys might find interesting. Of course, you're more than welcome to check them out. I would love to hear your comments. Again, if you do enjoy these videos, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. It's definitely the indicator that I use to uh, tell if you guys want to see more videos like that of that particular game style of that uh, you know series in the long run so when you guys leave comments down it helps me decide whether we should keep doing it as well as whether you want to see games like that in the future and here are a few of them right here I kind of picked out uh, a few of different genres we will be doing spotlights for other youtubers in the future so if you uh, want to get a little shout out definitely let me know if you group with me uh, chances are you will get a shout out in here eventually. But for now, these are just uh, four series that I have that I feel like uh, could use a little bit more attention and that you guys might actually enjoy as well. Thanks again for watching, guys, and we will definitely catch you all next time.